Hey friend, Chris Van Viver here from whylogicprorules.com, the website that helps you get the most you can out of Apple's Logic Pro 10. Today, we're gonna talk about how to properly share your projects with other people. And we're gonna focus on one specific function. This was kind of brought on on the fact that I have many readers who will send me their projects, whether it's for like consulting or mixed reviews or whatever the case may be. And if I'm not careful in spelling out some specific directions, I'll receive projects that are missing a few, if not all, of the audio files that should be attached to the project. Now, if you're not sending me projects, for example, but you're sending your collaborators your projects, this is just as helpful. Maybe you're writing a song with somebody and you're sending a Logic project back and forth. And it turns out that when you send them the project, they just have an empty project in front of them when they open it. Or vice versa, somebody sends you their project and it's just empty. And you're like, oh man, you know, and you got to go back and forth how to fix this. Well, Logic has a very helpful function called consolidate, and that's under the project management settings. It's very simple, actually. In this particular project, we're just going to go to file. We're going to go to project management, consolidate. This consolidate menu helps us track down all of those audio files, those EXS samples, everything that should be saved to your project. Sometimes when we save a new project, we don't select all of these options because if we go in the save dialog, file, save as, we have the same exact options under copy the following files to your project. What this means is, is that Logic collects all of those different files and sample types and saves them into your project folder or package. But sometimes, we forget to check mark all of these options. So under the project management settings with consolidate, we can go back and we can collect all of those files and samples. So we don't run into problems when we start to share our projects. As you upgrade your Mac or just, you know, get a new external hard drive and start migrating files from different hard drives, you don't want to lose files along the way. So under consolidate assets in the project, all we have to do is select everything that applies to the project. So in this case, it would be copy audio files, maybe some EXS instruments. I typically select all of these options just to be safe, and then you hit OK. And then Logic will go through, analyze, and find, and then bring those files into the project folder. So then when we quit this Logic project here, I want to go ahead and share this project with somebody. I can just click on it, right-click, go to Compress. From here, my Mac is going to compress and zip this project file into a zip file so I can upload it to Dropbox, Google Drive, whatever your preferred option is for uploading and sharing files. So I hope that was helpful for you. If it was, as always, I highly suggest subscribing to the YouTube channel, YLogic Pro Rules, or subscribing on the website itself, YLogicProRules.com. Every week I'm posting new videos, new emails, new posts to help you get the most you can out of Apple's Logic Pro 10. Thanks so much.